Everyone loves a good ghost story, and Mansfield University has its own ghost story. Hi, this is Carol Hoke from Howard Hanna Professionals. Here at Howard Hanna Professionals, we love our local history. North Hall in Mansfield was constructed in 1874 and originally housed the women's dormitories on the upper floors. There were also rooms in the attic on the seventh floor that served several purposes, including a musical practice room. North Hall was renovated many times with the North Wing added in 1894 where the atrium or well is located. North Hall was the centerpiece of Mansfield University but fell into disrepair in the 1970s when only the lower floors were used. In the 1970s, stories of a ghost started to circulate, according to an article written by Lou Bernard. North Hall was fully abandoned and boarded up in 1982 and just added to the stories. Abandoned, boarded up buildings were creepy and students continued telling stories of an unnamed student who haunted the building, some reporting sightings. In the earliest stories, the ghost had no name but was was simply referred to as a girl who died in the building. Most stories had a girl jumping to her death from the upper floor due to a broken heart where other stories said she was pushed. Students over the years have reported hearing strange, unexplained noises, the sound of footsteps, items moving on their own in the library, and unexplained music from the attic. As years went on, the ghosts acquired the name Sarah. So did Sarah actually exist, or were the students' imaginations running wild? Many ghost hunters claim to have communicated with Sarah. Some fairly recent historical research found that there was indeed a student from Dimmick, PA, named Sarah Woodruff on the list of 1866 graduates. But there is an asterisk next to her name marking her as deceased. So could the story be true? Could it really be Sarah Woodruff, a student who died over 150 years ago, still roaming Mansfield's famous North Hall? Or is Sarah just a name students chose for the ghost of North Hall? According to MU's website, several students died in 1874 from a typhoid epidemic caused by a contaminated well. Maybe it is one of them. North Hall was fully remodeled in 1996 as a library and is open to the public. You're welcome to come visit and see if you feel Sarah's presence. For all your real estate needs, call the professionals at Howard Hanna Professionals in Wellsboro and ask for Carol Hoke, Laurel Bear, Carolyn Stranary, or Sandy Stevens.